Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Dragon Warrior 3. In the last episode, we got the story unfolded. I recruited my party, which was the Earthbound crew. Grinded up a little bit and did all kinds of stuff. And now we're heading to the um, cave on the promontory, which is what somebody mentioned in the, uh, there to get to the Tower of Jima. So let's do our first little uh, uh, dungeon. Alright, so... This isn't too bad of a dungeon, it's just going to be actually quite small dungeon. It's pretty straightforward too, so... This is... I uh, get a new weapon here, a horned rabbit. So we're going to set that on fire, and then have Hunter and Tug, and Arabella go after the, the ravens. There we go. So, not too bad. And Tug goes up to the next level. Mm. Three goes by one point, agility goes by... You get a lot of agility. I guess it makes sense if he is a fighter. But Tilly goes up by one point, Luck goes by one point, and Max HP goes up by three points. Alright, so here, we're going to walk east. We're going to get there's a couple little... Have Tug go after that, and then Arabella go after. Oh, that works. Tug's so fast, too. Alright, so here we're gonna go east. Alright, anyway. Let's try it, Spell. Just for the heck of it. I doubt it'll work, but... Uh, it did work. Bye! <laughs> but here we get a treasure chest. And we get a medical arm. Anyway, now we're going to head north here. We're getting all the treasure chests. There's only a couple of treasure chests in here, so it's really not going to be too bad. Alright, so DK, you go after one of the horn rabbits, and you need to heal Tug. There. And you use a medical herb on DK. There. Jeez. Alright, this is a little bit tougher than I thought it was going to be. That's fine. There we go. Arabella finished it. Well, we're going to just get a couple little on in and treasure. There's a treasure chest right here. Basically, this are all in here. Oh god, we got a uh, surprise attack. Uh, it doesn't matter. They're all dead. All right, we get the Wayfarer's clothes. Uh, uh, so the wafer, I'm no. 
Alright, so now we're going to go ahead north here. Another treasure chest here. Ah, four slimes. I'm not worried about the slimes. Alright, anyway. Thunder P goes up to the next level already. Reap by one point, agility by one point, intelligence by one point, intelligence by one point. They're gaining levels and I'm, I'm, I'm still stuck on level two. We get 16 pieces of gold. Anyway, that's really all we can get here, so, so we're going to exit here and head back to um, Alahan to stock up a little bit, heal up, do a couple of and things, and then we're going to uh, actually go grab a couple of things. And I'm also going to talk to talk to somebody in Alahan to um, tell you what we're doing next, so. And that, there we go, I finally go up to the next level. But one point, one point agility, four point vitality, luck goes by one point, intelligence is one point, max HP, eight points. So that's good. So we're gonna get out of here. That's fine. Let's get rid of the slimes. Hunter P with the critical. There we go. And Arabella. And yes, I realized I spelt her name wrong. I realized that. Three goes by three points. Jelly goes by one point. Atelier goes by two points. Flut goes by one point. Intelligence by one point. Maximum HP five points. And P goes by three points. There we go. So we are rolling now. So we're just going to get out of here. There's basically in here was just to get a few iron and items. Nah. There was actually an enemy, in, another enemy in here that we could have ran into, but we never ran into it. So it's all right. Ah oh, man. Ooh, ooh, this might be tough. Tug is dark. Ooh, I really need to heal Tug up. Let's see if we can make it back to town without having to use an antidote herb. Alright, so now let's head back to Aliahan. I think that's what it's called. We got... Uh, we're just trying to get out of here. Run. Thank you. Alright, so let's get back to Ali Aliyah hand. There we go. Whew, that was close. <laughs> first things first, heal at the end. There we go. Alright, so now we can act. I'm going to go over here. Bye, few. 
Give a couple of them to Arabella. Get another medical herb, and then... And then one more for the... Because one of the areas that we're going to be going to here soon is going to have a lot of poison enemies, so we're going to be, we need to be prepared for that. Alright, so, let's check out this real quick. There's really nothing I need. Well, let's... Guys, I already got the copper sword and leather armor for her. Him. Let's just look at everybody to see what everybody needs. Club and leather armor. Might be able to get, a, get on the copper sword, which would probably be better. Uh... Might be able to get him some leather armor. And what about Arabella? Club and Wayfarer clothes? Okay. Uh, let's see. Let's get let's get a copper sword. Let's give that to Hunter. Let's see. Can he, he actually equip it? That's better. So there we go. <laughs> Alright, so, we're going to be... Headed off to the next area. Oh, so we got a surprise attack on them, okay. Alright, we got a... Um, I got a... And Arabella's getting stronger. So now we're going to head north. We should be in the town. Okay, that's the town of Reef. We're not going to head there yet, though. So right here, you notice there's a little patch of land. And this is where the tower is going to be at. So now we're in the Tower of Najima. Alright, so anyway, can't do anything about that door. Alright, so. We actually made it to the Tower of Najima now, so. And this place has a pretty high... Oh, we got a new enemy here. Giant Anteaters. That's the other one we could have saw in the uh, cave that we didn't see, so... Alright, so they have less than 11 HP. Or they have 11 HP. <laughs> they have 11 HP. Because I attacked for 10 and didn't finish it. So, okay. That's not a problem. And Tug goes up to the next level. Freak goes by 3 points. Agility by 3. Vitality by 3. Luck by 1. Intelligence by 1. And maximum HP 5. Alright, anyway, and here we get a treasure chest. You attain 30. Well, I forgot to tell, talk to the person. There's a thief in the jail. And Ali Hand, I'm supposed to talk to him. He says that he had a thief key, but it was, but he lost it in the tower. So that's actually our goal is we find the, the thief key. So we can start opening up some doors. So we got, we have the, uh, so we have to actually find the feast key. That's our goal for here. I may not be able to finish this all in one video because it's actually a little bit of a longer dungeon.
Alright, anyway, here we're going to enter a room of four pillars. There it is. Head in west. Uh, Alright, so here it is, the Tower of Najima. We're going to explore a little bit of this. Alright, so here. We got a new enemy here, Max Moss. That's right, Expel. Just what the heck of it. Right, they have what? They have nine HP. Uh oh. They, they essentially cast kind of a blind on us. Well, it doesn't matter. They're dead. Mm. So first thing first, we'll go down this path right here, or this chest right here, which could be good. So they, <laughs> ah, oh no, 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 <laughs> this might be bad. Because when you do that mirage, it's basically blind. <coughs> well, there's a re uh, there's a lot of things to do in this, but that's the ultimate goal to find the thief's key. Like I said, I, there was a thief I was supposed to talk to in um, Alley Hand after, in the jail. That tells you that he lost his uh, key in the Tower of Yojima, which is where we're at. Good afternoon, welcome to the Wayfarer's Den. Yes, more rest. I'm gonna end the video here, too. Alright, we're gonna end the video here, guys. When we come back, we're gonna continue looking through the Tower of Yojima to find the Thief's Key and see what we can do about it in here. And, um, do... And then we're going to head off to some new areas, all kind of stuff, and probably get some upgrades. So, but uh, our number one goal right now is to find the thief key, which is in this t uh, tower. And after that, there was a thief I was supposed to talk to an alley hand in the jail that said that he had a thief's key, but he lost it in the tower. So that's where, that's how you're supposed to know to go here to look for the thief's key. But we'll get that next time on Let's Play Dragon Warrior Three. This is DKS Three, the Crazy Gamer. Signing out.